Jeremy Poinsano has beaten some of the best golfers in the world to be named a world champion. While that certainly is impressive on its own, what's even more impressive, he's accomplished all of this without the ability to see. This is a story about an amateur, one you've probably never heard of. But nonetheless, a story his caddy claims Perfect. you just have to see to believe. So it's just amazing. I'm just very impressed. 21-year-old Jeremy Poinsano has been playing golf most of his life. I played on the middle school golf teams, high school golf teams. But it wasn't until two years ago, while in college, he started seeing the game and life a little differently. In a matter of two months, Sweet. my vision went from 2020 to no central vision whatsoever. Jeremy is legally blind. He suffers from Lieber's hereditary optic neuropathy, a very rare hereditary disease with no cure. Jeremy describes his view of the world as a donut. He is able to see peripherally with a big hole in the center. I can't read, I can't drive, I can't distinguish faces, and I now play competitive blind golf. Not just play. <laughs> He's the blind golf world champion, beating out players from 14 countries, thanks to a lot of help from his caddy. Right down the middle. Give it a good rip. You'll be right side. Oh, it's fading a little bit. And then as soon as the ball is gone, I have to tell him where it goes because he has no idea. Very nice shot. Very nice shot. Of course, this Give caddy is learning something, too. Yep. <laughs> it's unbelievable the attitude he has. You know, he's happy. I've gone skydiving three times since I lost my sight. Ran a half marathon, never did that before. I mean, you, there's, you won't know till you try. Yeah, perfect. And there's a reason these two are in sync. Nice. Yeah, we're, we're, I think we're as close as father-son could be. A caddy golfer relationship even a pro could learn from. Oh, gosh. He landed right by the pin. And proof yeah. it's not what happens that matters, but rather perfect. how you look at it. I'm not bummed out about it at all. I mean, I wouldn't asked to go back in time and change it i'm i'm totally fine with it and it's it's what keeps me unique points to know has been raising money and awareness of lhon with sponsored bike rides half marathons and even skydives and he says these are all things he would have never done if it weren't for this disease